So for the average person who lives here that uh, doesn't know about fish rooms and so on, uh, they're blown away. The first words out of their mouth is, my God. But anyway, you're looking straight ahead at the ficus tree that I've taken from Long Island, pruned it. It's, it's looking really nice. Uh, I may be repetitious if you've seen former videos, but just to give you an idea of how this room was laid out, uh, Judy, uh, her one orders were, you could have a fish room, but I don't want it in the middle of the room. Uh, I, I don't want anything in the middle of the room. Well, I broke that a little bit uh, because she, we found this great rug that I think went with the room. But uh, anyway, I'll take you around fairly quickly. And if you like what you see, I could spend more time another time taking tanks. So just to give you a panoramic, I have a tank of water behind the chair and I run a hose from the room that you haven't seen yet but that fills that tank. Uh, we'll get back to that chair at the end. So anyway, going around the room, uh, I think this tank would be the most interest to Leica uh, because I have a very nice school of Jordanella Faraday. Uh, Jeff gave me some young at the end of the season. I grew them up, they bred outside. So I'm, I'm happy with the way this school is and I brought in some pears if anybody had wanted in the past. Uh, somehow I got into mollies. Uh, I'll show you the adults and I may, uh, not this time, but the next time I'll bring in some pears if you guys like it. But I have a, a nice batch of fry. I'll show you what the adults look like in a little while. So I try to fit as many tanks as I can that you can see properly. I got some platies, I got guppies, just assorted. But this is the same stand I had in my former fish room. So I'm able to keep uh, the, some killifish and uh, speaking about those platies, i uh, show you on the bottom. Male is in the front. I separated them to see if we get some more fry, but I want to see if I do have, uh, I know I got those, so I want to see which ones and I have pears to bring in. Uh, let's see. Because this is just going to be a little short video just to give you an idea of what's here, I'll continue around. So Harry convinced me that the main thing you need is a place to put things. Uh, I haven't sorted that. That needs some organization. But uh, it's been a big help. Okay. Uh, the, uh, the main purpose is, uh, I know Joe Fredenzi and Jules and Victor are, are we're trying, are trying, and maybe I'll have some Ju Jordan, uh, Julia Chromis Malloroy. Uh, so this is the tank that they're going to go in and uh, Let's see if I could get a close-up. So this is the one fish that I have left over when I had to move my fish and, and uh, the tank that they were in crashed. So I lost my whole nice school. This one somehow survived. So it's waiting to get some brothers and sisters. But um, I like this tank a lot and I, I like to fish so we'll see if I could uh, get a school. Uh, <clears throat> Mike McNamee had given me this tank and it's come in handy so it fits in nicely here. So 
going around the room, I'm going to try to get this poinsettia to flower, um, letting it go through the light cycle. Uh, and I, actually, I, I think you'll see this is not only a fish room, but it's a combination of plants, memorabilia, and so on. Uh, or as Judy says, junk. <laughs> but anyway, uh, I hope Jeff is doing well. I gave him a, a brother or sister of this pitcher plant. Uh, I'm going to experiment to get some uh, propagated uh, both by seeds and cutting, so we'll see. But it's a great plant. Um, it was in a different position in this room. I actually chose to film today because it's a cloudy day, so normally this room is bright light, which is great for the plants. Um, okay, I said I'd get back to the chair. And the television set reminded me, uh, just before I left Long Island, uh, I wanted one of Ron and uh, uh, Ron's outings, uh, I want a TV set, uh, which is this one. Uh, Frank was kind enough to hold it for me. And Judy somehow got a point like this room, especially when um, it's nice and sunny. So this chair is for her to watch the TV. Um, a big contributor to this room is Joe DeRosa. Joe was in, in the process of moving uh, a couple years ago. And anyway, he gave me this mini uh, plant stand, which is great. The lights are incredible and the plants, uh, obviously Joe has a few plants. And uh, to make it even better, um, he remembered that uh, when I was at the college, I was into horseshoe crabs. So these horseshoe crabs are actually from Joe Fredenzi, uh, Joe DeRosa. Joe Fredenzi never gets out of my mind. He's the one that got me into doing the uh, fish show, uh, fish rooms, and somewhere I forget, it's somewhere in that, uh, it's still memories of it. Actually, now I remember. So, here's that one, and these are the winners. Actually, everybody was a winner. Everybody had a good time on that uh, show. Uh, so it's heading up to the winter, so I brought in a few plants, see how they make out. That's it for now.